Okay. Ready? Okay. Um, well, I've also had a chance to review the budget to a certain um, extent, and I love that we're cutting the budget, and I commend the manager for taking initiative on something that I personally ran my campaign on and being fiscally responsible. I think that's very important. I could see, you know, maybe we can even cut more, but um, it is difficult to make such an extensive decision on something that, you know, has no we haven't seen presentations from directors and there's really not a lot of backup on a lot of the items which concerns me a bit um you know a proposed amended budget would be to add you know if you had new administration coming in or you had someone like the mayor added a clerk to his staff that would need appropriations and you would need to um, find a place in the budget to be able to pay those people and that would be an amendment when you're making an increase up that you need to budget for um, what I see here is, let's call it what it is, a new budget. Uh, this to me is not a budget amendment, this is a brand new budget, and being that we should be working on next year's budget, I see it kind of as a waste of resources in our city and taxpayer dollars because really a lot of this could have been done administratively. Just because the money is budgeted, to my knowledge, doesn't mean we have to spend it. At the end of the year, there would have been a surplus, and we could have put that into um, the reserves, being that there are a lot of administrative decisions that the money didn't have to be spent. For example, the police department is not being uh, built out. That was $7 million that um, this council hadn't even seen plans for. So that was in the budget, but it wasn't going to be spent. Um, I believe previous council had agreed to put it in there in case of that land that could have been lost. I think that the previous council didn't want that to happen, and um, that's why it was placed. And again, I commend your department or your office, Mr. Manager, for finding so many cuts. They're, I'm, I'm not saying that they're not great. I, I looked at them and I think that a lot of it needed to be done. Um, however, I am concerned as to the process. I think um, that our city has had a process for many years. I've looked back at the videos and it's always been a few week budget workshop. Being that some of us are up here for the first time, um, I think it's important that we go through that process to be able to understand what we are actually cutting. I saw some cuts on like utility. I don't know how you're going to cut utility. Are you going to turn the lights off at three o'clock in the afternoon? I mean, there's there's certain things that, you know, I know we're saying we're not cutting services and we're adding staff, but um, I would love to know how that's that's really going to happen to a certain extent because it's tough to cut so much and then not cut services. At some point, it does it does go into that. Um, I saw also that police um, overtime is being cut, and not saying that that's not a good or bad decision. I'm saying that that's something that needs some thought and needs some input from this council. And I believe that this council hasn't had the um, the one voice to your office as far as to what is going to be cut. Um, I think that we're all pretty much in consensus that that it's great that we're cutting the budget because we all want to be fiscally responsible and, and really protect the taxpayer dollars. But at the same time, I think it needs to be done with a clear, <coughs> clear vision of what is going to come out of this council. So um, I too, I mean, I don't know if we can even, I, I also looked at the notice of this, how this meeting was noticed. Unfortunately, I had a medical emergency and I was not here in the last meeting. But I noticed that this meeting was um, scheduled, uh, was called as a special meeting amending the fiscal year 2012-2013 budget. Um, to me, it's a little vague. I was thinking that what we were going to have here was a budget workshop to then eventually get to the amending of the budget. So I don't know if it's even appropriate, Mr. City Attorney, if we could maybe... Um, call to have a workshop maybe within the next two weeks. I mean, I'm, again, I'm all for this. I think that we should go through the last year's budget, um, but I'm, think, I'm thinking that it needs to be done in a better procedure by having workshops um, for us to understand and have each of the directors come up here and give us a proper uh, analysis of what's being cut from their budget and how it's gonna affect them or how it's not gonna affect them. Um, and then us be able to give them that input. I mean, I believe that's how it's been done in the past, where it's always been a workshop that takes two or three weeks to then, you know, to then approve a budget. To me, this isn't a budget amendment. This is a brand new budget. I mean, you're cutting a lot of things here. If you were adding a few things, then I would say, sure, how is this gonna 
affect us? How are we going to, um, how's, our, how's our city going to come out of this? And then we'd be able to do it. But I mean, this is, you know, a lot of work and um, a whole new budget. So that's where I stand at this moment. 